Hello again, everyone. We are Gaming by Gaslight. Welcome back to Lord of the Rims. When we last left off, we had just arrived at old, uh, old hilltop here. And, yeah, we're getting ready to go fight ourselves a dragon. Oh, you know what else we also probably want to do? Uh, oh yeah, here's a funny side story. As I was getting us ready, uh, we got, we got attacked by a raid, but... There were some giant spiders hanging around for some reason, and said giant spiders, yeah, murdered the raid for us. So that was pretty fortunate, all things considered, because it could have actually gone really, really poorly for us. Anyway, once Illyrian is done tending to our prisoner here, I, I think I'm going to send her and our alpacas off to go join in the, the battling. And by that, I mean... Like, I want more animals to to help us, <clears throat> potentially. Actually, maybe we can just try taming some muffalo here. Well, actually, you know what? We really don't need a lot of male muffalo. So yeah, only the youngest males. And I guess the youngest, youngest-ish females. There we go. Because, I mean, the people we've got here are pretty good at handling, aren't they? Yeah. Also, you may notice we have, like, Primula instead of Foster. Uh, because Foster was broken, as you may recall in the last episode, I, I just deleted her from existence and then just, like, ruled a new colonist. Because I figured that was, uh, the fairest and most balanced solution to a broken pawn. I mean, I, I guess, in a way, maybe that, maybe that wasn't, because Foster was still, like, actively doing stuff, it's just I had no control over her, and apparently she was, like, broken in every possible way to interact with her, so, yeah. It just seems sensible to not, uh, have to deal with that. Also, uh, let's see here, with, uh, security, thinking to myself, I mean, we've got, and we've got a bunch of granite blocks lying around, maybe make some granite deadfall traps try to trip up the dragon as best we can. Try to lure it into a, uh, wow, 70. Okay, that's actually a lot. Uh, oh, we don't even have enough to really, yeah, to really make, uh, too many traps here. So, yeah, maybe that's, maybe that's not the best idea. I'm gonna go ahead and claim that. Let's say that's ours now. And that'll be ours too. That way the dragon can't just break through it. All right. Actually, I suppose I could do that with a lot of these. Like you, sir. You can, like, hide in... And I could just have the dwarves hiding in doorways. I mean, it, it, it technically works. But no, I don't really want to do that. I want to make sure that we're all, um... We're all fighting side by side, like rubbers in arms or something. All right, you, uh, yeah, you, uh, go stand here. All right, let's, uh, slowly get everyone into something resembling a warrior's position here. All right. Okay, you're going over there. You are consuming that meal. I'll let you continue to do that. Colin, let's squeeze you in there. Khajiit, you go there. Strorin. We're cooking. Cat is playing some horseshoes, but now you're going to be shooting things. Is there anyone else wandering around doing so? Oh, also, yeah, the insects over here decided to kill us, so I guess we don't really have access to that anymore. Also, yeah, let's uh, expand our allowed area here. I kind of did like an inverse thing just to make sure no one wandered in here by accident. Where I just filled out that area and then went in. Okay, good. Uh, Oin, where are you going? Okay, you're gonna haul some jelly. I guess I can let you do that. You are considering resting, but I actually want you to, like, go over here. Okay, you've got a bow. You've got a bow. Someone... Oh, cat's going to stand there, huh? You've got a bow. You've got a sword. I'm gonna have you go there. Alright, we're gonna have to send... One person to go lure the dragon over. 
But as long as we keep our positions good, we, we should be fine, actually. You know what? We'll get the insect jelly later. Right now, just uh, cover your brothers in arms here. All right. Now what's going on? Colin, calm your testicles, man. You'll be fine. Okay. Yeah, you'll you'll be fine. God help us, we'll be fine. Probably. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, everyone's everyone's in position. Okay, Foley, you go over here. Okay. Oh shit, the dragon's coming. Uh where do I want you to stand, Foley? I guess over here. Run! Run, you fool! Oh, I should have had traps through there. And Foley is already down. Holy shite, your leg was bitten off. That is... Not good. Holy balls. Okay, all the melee people, I'm gonna, like, say, hey, don't mail it, or don't be, uh... Don't be recruited anymore. I want you to just get in there and, like, stab this thing. Oh, God. Are you actually shooting? You are apparently not shooting. Can you not see the dragon? Actually, don't call in you, uh, yeah. Go attack the dragon. And we're all, we're close enough we shouldn't get friendly fire. I hope. Okay, are we actually, like, killing this, uh, this behemoth? Oh, I should have, I could have done this in such a... Oh my god, I took out his eyeball. Nicely done, Gaslight, nicely done. Oh yeah, bitches! <laughs> we killed the dragon. Alright. Okay, go rescue Folly, please. Okay, yes! You defeated the enemy outpost, the payment has arrived. And faction relations have approved by eight. Wow, those uh, those dwarves sure, they sure know their stuff. I mean, did you see that? They, uh... all right. Oh my God, we can try to tame the dragon. I mean. I mean, we, we, we have to, right? I mean, this is just like with, um, it's just like with, uh, a muffalo or a, a frumbo. Like, you don't really succeed by trying to tame it. You succeed by, uh, like, you, uh, you rescue it once it's on the ground. And then, like, every time you, uh, you, like, tend to it, it has a small chance of, uh, who's our, like, I don't know if animal handling has anything to do with this, but, uh, Rescue the... Oh, yeah, let's, uh... Let's do this. Rescue, rescue the... Rescue the dragon. Okay, you guys are, like, gonna... Like, get treated, right? How many body parts have we lost in this? Oh, boy. We're dragon killers, though! Oh, well, what's going on with you, Miz? You're... You're dying over there. Consuming a weak stew. What is Primula doing? All right, you're the closest person who might be able to do something about this, so yeah, go tend to go tend to the bleeding dwarf, would you kindly? As fully the one. Oh my, you lost a leg. Right. Uh, could you um, yeah, maybe uh, maybe tend to our our friend here. Okay. All right. And then the idea is basically we we try to tame the dragon by uh because ev every uh, every single one of these uh, injuries that we patch up has a small chance of um, recruiting the dragon. I mean, like how badass would that be? All right, Callan, you've got to you've got to do this, man. Because if we can tame the dragon, then that's even better than killing a dragon. This is gonna go very poorly for me though, isn't it? But I mean, there's like so many chances, so much opportunity for winning here. I mean, like, the winning, it, it's just, it just doesn't stop at this point. Like this is, uh, this is, this is good. 
Let's claim everything as our own. All right. Claim it. Claim it. Claim it. Claim it. Claim it. Claim it. Oh, hell. Oh, it, it's it's that game. Who will have to rename, of course. All right. I mean, I'll be honest. This could actually horribly, horribly backfire. But, it, I mean, seriously. If it is at all possible to tame this dragon, we've, we've got to try, right? You are making efforts to, like, patch the bleeding wounds, right? Not the, uh... Not like these. I mean, I've got to be honest, I'm... I'm rather impressed. Don't worry, Foley, we'll get you. Oh, gosh, diddly darn it, Colin. You better not break on me, man. What? What is your medicine skill, anyway? Oh, it's only two. All right, well, let's get Oin on this, then. I'm not, I'm not sure if handling has anything to do with it. But Oin is, Oin is our best medic, right? Yes. Okay. All right. Good. Oh, for the love of all that is good and holy. All right. Tend to yourself. Uh, tell Roar, you tend to yourself. Did you lose any body parts? Yeah, you lost an ear. Which, when you think about it, is actually pretty good. Uh, damn, Finn, there you are. You lost a foot. Can I, uh, add a, a foot? No. Okay. Can't just give you- well, I, I could give you a peg leg, right? No, we have no herbal medicine left. Well, that's, uh, the real onion in the ointment. Um, Romri, you're, you're healthy, right? Yeah. I want you to go around and, like, check out all these, all these rooms, see, uh, see what there is to see. Get an idea of what sort of goodies. All right, there's some, like, random food here. Some beds. Cool, cool. What is Folly doing? Hauling some rotted mush. That's perfectly fine and normal. All right, I mean, I'll admit, I'm not, uh... I'm not terribly... All right, uh, Storin, can I actually get you to... Maybe clean some of the blood? Oh, here's the jackpot. Emu fat ointment, huh? Nice. Nice stuff right there. I mean, we obviously gotta take all the dwarven gold. Like, that just goes without saying. Ah, hell. Oh, and here's the armory. God, I'm, I am so happy that 1.0 has, like, a mass unforbid tool. Or, yeah, just, like, a mass tool for... Wait, why did this get open? Oh, because we were in there, but then I, I left. Okay. Yeah. Check out all the rooms. At least, you know, as best we can. All right. That's some, that's some good stuff. And there's even, looks like there's stuff behind these walls right here, maybe. Then watch, there was, like, a secret, a secret door back there this whole time. All right, what else do we got here? All right, there's another dead guy. I mean, there's there's lots of dead people out in the world. That's all cool. And stuff. And we're obviously not going to be able to take everything with us unless, like, we do go ahead and... Um... Oh, so much winning. This is good. Honestly, it wasn't even as difficult as I thought it was going to be. Like, it was challenging, don't get me wrong, but it was not bad. It was not bad. This was actually one of the most impressive things I think I've done in my RimWorld career. I think I'll leave the corpses. I mean, if we wanted to be, like, true, true, true warriors, we would at least dig them some graves or something. 
Which maybe we will do that. Maybe we'll even make them start some sarcophagi. We could do that. Oh yeah, where's our... Uh... Alright, we got some new clothes. Got a new uh, bed there. Alright, let's uh, head on inside, shall we? Get another peek at what's going on in here. Alright, there's yet another door for us to claim. A lot of furniture, too. I mean, to be honest with you, we could go ahead and, um, like, maybe even, maybe even just, uh, like, make this as a secondary base or something. I mean, we, we'll probably want to do sawing just to make sure we have enough time to actually, oh, good lord. Oh, a graphic novel. Those are always cool. All right. But yeah, this, uh, oh, hell. Okay, uh, oh, self-tend is disabled a few, huh? All right. Oh, someone was actually going to attend to you. How? Okay, Oyen is still taking care of the dragon, huh? You know what? We're going to end up using too much uh, herbal medicine on this thing. Let's, let's not worry about these things. All right, there we go. We have unlocked all the things. We're probably going to want to hunt this spider down. And yeah, and everything else, uh, I guess, belongs to us. The To the winner go the spoils. Uh, speaking of, we're probably going to want to build a few, a few more of these in order to store all this food that we have acquired. Alright, that's, that's looking pretty good as far as I'm concerned. I mean, it's, uh, it's very rough here right now. Let's say, uh, yeah, let's try to clean some of this blood up. If we can, because that would be great. I mean, oh hell, what? The giant spider is hunting a spider. Well, at least it's not hunting us. Ah, heck. Anyway. Oh, Telroy, could you uh, attend to yourself? Good man. All right. And the... Oh, and the dragon died. Well, at least it was practice. All right, let, let's butcher this this thing. Oh wow, it's actually pretty cool in here. But yeah, let's uh, let's butcher up the old boy and you know get that sexy dragon lever that everyone loves. All right, you uh, yeah, you're tended to, you're tended to, you're not actually tended to, are you? Yeah, could you could you tend his uh, wounds first before you do anything else? And then uh, we'll go back up to the world map, which we apparently haven't loaded. At least not in this particular recording anyway. And... Yeah, we're gonna wanna... We're gonna wanna send Illyrian, I reckon, from a caravan. I mean, she's also second only to Delgarander for carrying stuff. So yeah, we'll uh, carry... I don't know, like five stews. That should be plenty enough. And we'll make sure we escape to the northeast. And there we go. Yeah, because we're going to need the extra the extra mounts. And by mounts, I mean animals. Are you still patching yourself up? Good god, man. Well, at least we're going to have, like, some sweet scars. And if uh, Evil Knievel... I believe it was Evil Knievel who said this. Taught us anything. It's that chicks dig scars, man. Chicken spider eggs. That's just creepy to think about but anyway yeah so aside from that we're we're winning and winning is good all right let's uh let's make another dumping zone and uh let's let's put it right here big ol uh seven by seven dumping zone it's gonna be of critical importance allow rotten and allow only corpses and uh, not animal, not mechanoid. Only, yeah, I guess strain. Yeah, basically just that. And we're gonna 
We're gonna dump all the dead bodies here, and we'll I, we're either going to burn them, or we are going to, you know, take the time to build some sarcophagi for them, and then, you know, leave them here. Even though we're probably gonna ultimately abandon this place, it still seems like the right thing to do. Uh, what? No, 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 no. Hell no. Oh. Hell no. Oh. Like, what is, what is this bullshit? Good sir. I don't, I don't like that idea. You're still patching yourself up, apparently. Like, I figured if anyone was gonna break, it'd be Kyal in here. But, come on, people. Alright, well, you're not slaughtering our, our animals, you idiot. Okay. Oh boy. Some people, they just make me so mad, huh? Alright. So you are going to enter this ancient danger. Oh right, 3.2 days. Food is only going to last for two of those days. Alright, overall though, um, we should be fine. Like, things should balance themselves out. Or, hopefully they'll balance themselves out. Uh, Strorin, you would, I'd actually really like it if, uh, yeah. Let's restrict everyone to Area 1 for now, just so that maybe we can, uh... No, no, no. Get... get in here. Idjit. Get in there. Mad animal. Alright. Uh, Area 1 does include... Here, right? Yeah, so... Go ahead and... Prioritize cleaning all that blood. That local hair, we'll do that. You go over here. Oin is tending to Danny's. Alright. I mean, we're... We're slowly getting some stuff done. Sort of. Which we'll have to do, honestly. I mean, seriously, if we can clean this up... Oh god, there's so many people mad. Why are you so mad? Uh, oh, the rotting corpse thing. Oh, that's annoying. Anyway. Such is life. So, I guess, you know, this is what we've gotta do, and... You know, you gotta do what you gotta do. So, we'll... we'll try to balance things, we'll try to keep people... You know, not dead. And we will get out of here with as much loot as we possibly can. Which is good, as far as I'm concerned. And, yeah, all right. So, loot, victory, and good times. I mean, we slayed a dragon. How many people get a claim they can do that, huh? Anyway, yeah, that's it for this episode. So, until the next time, as always, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that like button or maybe leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're thinking, and I will see all of you in the next video.